think this, uh, I think this might be the sequel to Taioku Aigu Goliath. It's just, this game just has a Daiden at the end of the title. So it's like, it's like the Pokemon Blue and Red game. It's, it's like the same game pretty much, but it's like, there's like a few differences, and, like, you got, you got different characters. You gotta be Gramps, of course, I mean, if there's an old man character, that usually means he's a drunken master, and he's indestructible, so we'll name him Tiki Tan. Key. Or no, that's an I. Or is that an I? Let's see. A. Okay, who cares? Who cares? I know, I know. That's Key Key. Okay. So anyway, where's the, where's end? So uh, you, you can, there's tra cross trade compatibility if you have the uh, Super Nintendo Link cable. It's, not, it's a pretty, pretty uh, rare device, actually. They go for about, about a thousand on eBay. But uh, if you get one of those, you can trade characters from this game to the other one, or you could just simply buy both versions of the game. I'm sure they'd be, be just a tad cheaper. I think this game goes for only 200 or so now. So here we go, we got, we got our, got your local go board, just pop your piece down, look at that, that's a beautiful pristine, look at the shadowing on that baby. That, 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 that wins, hands down. Black Circle Go Piece of the Year award, Howard C. Nils, Black Go Piece of the Year. Very r rare and um, important honor to to obtain. So we'll just uh, close the spool in here. He's probably he's probably about to. Oh, what the, what the hell is that? That is. I hate little trick moves like that. It's just you little. Oh, it's disgusting. Whatever. Look at oh, it's like it's like a peace sign though. That's what I'm talking about. It's Howard Senior's peace hour. I don't know, what the hell am I talking about? This will alright, that's it, that's it. Frickin' whip out my chain and just start beating this fool across the head. Show him how to play Go. But yeah. I mean, if you're if you're a Go fan, I'm sure this I'm sure these Go games would be just amazing. I mean this is this is pretty good. But like I mean I don't I don't know how to play, so well, I kind of do, but I suck at it, obviously. <laughs> like, look at that. It's like it's like a new 2000 movie right there. But but if you're a go fan, I'm sure these games would be like a wet dream come true. Times a thousand, so. Check it out if you are, but if you're not, if you're like me, don't check it out. So from a non-go person perspective, I'll get, this one's actually it's fast-paced and decent. Got a little sweet soundtrack. I mean, I'm going to go to Amazon.com right now and buy it after this review, but I'll, I'll give the game about a 5. That's, that's, that's pretty damn good for my standards, but I mean, if you're a fan, though, this will probably be like a 9 or 10. But anyway, I'll see you. Oh, freaking phone's ringing. I'll see you guys. Oh, I think I'm going to do one more review.